WTFNN. Headline news update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 2 p.m. Eastern time on Wednesday, two hours left to go in the trading day, and we got markets in positive territory. As I say that, Dow just slipping into negative, negative by two points, trading at 26,146. We've got the NASDAQ positive by 43 points, trading at 79.52. S&Ps positive by six points, trading at 28.84. We have the Fed minutes coming out right now as we speak, 2 p.m. Eastern time. We'll see if we put that some volatility into the market. Jumping over to the futures markets, we'll start things off with the S&P. So near the session highs that we made basically 7 a.m. Eastern time this morning, 2890. <clears throat> we have the S&Ps trading at 2889 currently. Dow 30, a little bit of a different story. We were up there this morning at about 26,228. We trade to a low this afternoon, this morning, 10 a.m. of 26,108. Just kind of hanging down there for most of the day, 26,143 in the Dow. We got NASDAQ 100 trading at 76.20, just off the highs of 76.30, made about two and a half hours ago. Crude oil, a little bit of volatility. We got the EIA number today at 10.30 a.m. Eastern Time. There's your volatility on 10.30. We saw a build of 7 million barrels. The, estimation, the estimate had been for a build anywhere between two and a half to three. Nonetheless, oil trades higher, up to 64.56. Gold contract trading higher as well, 13.1251, and Euro US dollar. We had the ECB with Draghi talking this morning, 8.30 a.m. He was out there. We also had CPI data at 8.30 a.m. this morning. Lots going on, but the Euro come right back to where we were, 112.72. And as we said, Fed minutes coming at us. The first headlines make coming out there. Fed majority saw risks warranting rates on hold through 2019. Uh, here's the text of the minutes. So they get the text up there. Several Fed officials noted rate views could shift. Either way, Fed officials saw significant uncertainties around the outlook. Very minor reaction in the markets, though, as we just went over the charts. Not too much happening so far. And to bring it to the currencies, there's your dollar index trading at 90. 9689 has been had been as high as 97200 there's the euro that we took a look at already and then you get the yen trading at 11090 and the good old pound back above 131 13113 Stay tuned. We got our man Dave White coming up right now with the Power Trading Hour. And of course, Tom O'Brien wraps things up live from 3 till 5. Those Fed minutes unchanged for the rest of the year. That's what Dave's saying. He's reading those minutes. Get ready, folks, right now. Dave White with the Power Trading Hour. Have a great day.